Angie comes to the set and it's like, she's the one person that we've all been told to stay away from because she's Stallone's girl, right? So everybody's like on pins and needles, like don't talk to Angie. She's the one that's gonna be a real winner, you know? And then she comes to the set and she's like super nice and friendly and like really warm and like wonderful with everybody. And like, she has a great attitude and she's super sweet. And I'm just like so confused now. <laughs> I was just like, wait a minute. The one that we're supposed to stay away from because she's supposed to be like super bitchy and super like stuck up and she's all Stallone this and Stallone that. And like, he's going to be watching everything and making sure nobody talks to her and da 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 da. And she's super sweet now going and like, hey, do you want to come to lunch with me? Or what are you doing? Like, it's like, yeah. And so nice. And then like Eric Olaniak is like, and Dennis Miller's like, and everybody's like, and I'm like, what is this set? Come on, dude, let's party. Corey is never boring. <laughs> He's never boring. Um, there's another character that I got along with. He's, you know, he just, he fit so well in this movie because he is one of these bad boys. And he just, He's a nice guy. I really like Corey. I really do. I had fun with him. He was one of the people that I really had fun with on set. <laughs> yeah, I just remember Corey was so energetic and like enthusiastic and full of really great... He was just very um, enthusiastic and energetic and friendly. That's what I remember about Corey. I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to get the job. I'm happy to be working on a Universal movie. I'm good, you know? Um, but it seemed like everybody else in the world was not happy about being there. And I just, I, to me, I couldn't understand it. A bunch of the B cast, you know, that was there, like all the strippers and all that. And of course we all got along just fine. <laughs> but I actually ended up dating a couple of the girls uh, from there, which uh, one of them was the Patricia, uh, the girl that I ended up with who had the extra boob. Her and I actually hung out like every weekend, so we had a great time. I guess I finally found a girl with a little something extra. So we go to Vancouver to make